head back to my car. But I'm going to show you the last part. Of this we're on the other side of the street here, and I'm in front of La Quintana Mexican Grill. This place used to have the best breakfast burritos ever I've ever had. Sadly, they don't do breakfast anymore. Uh, but man, it was good. It was a great place to go. Um, Scar Therapy Child Development Center. Okay. All right, and then here's another part of downtown Hollister. All right, there's the, we have the welcome to Hollister sign. Established 1872, stop sign, so that person stopped, which they did, thank you. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of complaining about that. Okay, Gablin Chapter Seneca. Wine and food tasting Saturday, August 17th. So I might come to that. I might attend that. I don't drink alcohol, but who knows? Here's that building I was talking about. There's that other building that's been abandoned forever. I hate to say it, but if they're they can't turn into apartments, apparently it's covered in asbestos. That's the problem. And asbestos used to be a big thing. Oh, hey. Paloma Massage Therapy. All right, hey, I may go in there and get a massage. That'd be kind of nice. There's a foot massage place downtown, down the street that's really good. Here's a furniture store. So lots of furniture stores here. Uh, I don't know what that is. A salon, another salon. There's an outhouse. That's probably for the homeless so they'll use the toilet on the street. Alright, this is a... Wow, this is a cool store. Hollister Downtown Association Office Hours. Wow. Okay. Nice. I didn't even know this was here. So this is a Downtown Association. That's kind of cool. So here's the pro club. This used to be, it's called a, it used to be a pharmacy, old school pharmacy. Here's Wells Fargo. Used to be a world savings there. It was a great bank. I, I love that bank. it is there's the freelance they still print paper all right this is heavily bakery lots of good stuff in there all right so I'm gonna go in here and buy something because I'm kind of hungry is fat guy's backpack after all so they may not let me film this so i'm going to see if they let me film inside if they don't i'll turn off and uh, i'll show you what i get after all hey thank you how you doing pretty good um we're in heavenly bakery and what was your name sophia hi sophia this is sophia um, I love Heavily Baked because they the best pastries. I probably like became fat guy in the back then. Um, Alright, so I just want to chuck a picture. But this is in downtown Hollister. They have the best bakery stuff you've ever had. So come and check it out. you want the regular chocolate or a chocolate? Um, let's do regular chocolate. The, the chocolate one here? The full chocolate one? Yeah, which are good with coffee too. Is bacon not fried? It's just stuff with butter. Uh, yeah. See all the great stuff they have here? No, that'd be it. Okay. So this is cash or card? A card. That's $2.59.
Sophia, right? Yeah. All right, Sophia. Thanks. See, I'm Welcome. Fat Guys Backpack. Don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> you, can, right. you can be subscriber number 100. Okay, have a good day. You too. Thank you. you could be subscriber 100. Fat Guy in his backpack. That's coffee tub. Awesome. There you, you heard it. You heard it. So there we go. That's wow. Heavenly Bakery. That's a one, that's kind of a, a Hollister institution. That place has been here for years. Uh, Hopefully I'm recording. Yep, but all right. So we're headed back to my car. But here's some more heavily scent spa, uh, day spa salon. So if you ever want to do something nice for your wife, I bet she or a girlfriend, I bet she'd like that. What else do we have here? Uh, San Benito ben, ben, Benito Ben. I'm not sure what that is. Like specialty stores. So that's what downtowns are for nowadays, which I think is cool. Living retirement, preparing, so you want to prepare for to die. Books and coffee. Farmhouse. Wow. Cafe. That's pretty cool. Let's see, what are their hours? I don't drink coffee. They're closed. My car, so we're back in front of the uh, Vets Memorial Building it's closed otherwise I'd go in there but there we go so hopefully knock on wood this uh, episode hopefully the sound worked this time I didn't have it on slow-mo it says normal so I should be fine there I'm gonna go to my car enjoy my delicious cook chocolate cookie from Heavenly Bakery read some more of my undaunted courage um, by the way, I am listening to, as far as audiobooks, I almost forgot, I was going to mention this. Uh, let me bring it up. It's called, Un it's called By the Light of the Moon. It's a really good book. Um, I have a summer series of books I like to read, or listen to, sorry. And this just happens to be one of them. Uh, mainly because a big portion of it takes place in Arizona and New Mexico. So uh, that's my whole thing. But it, it's written by a guy named Colm. C or K O O N T Z. I think his first name is Steven, but I could be wrong on that. Uh, it was called By the Light of the Moon. He's done. He did lots of great books. For I'm told, I I've got a few of his audio books I enjoyed listening to. But it's called By the Light of the Moon, and it's a great book. It's about this mad scientist guy. He injects these innocent people. And they get these powers and they they you know they can do certain things so if you're into audiobooks or everything curious about a good summer audiobook uh, Jaws is another great one but this is uh, called by the light of the moon by Combs K-O-O -O, I'm sorry K-O-O-N-T-Z great guy uh, great uh well, i don't know he's a great guy but he does really good books and if this is a good audiobook good summer book uh and i highly recommend it so anyways i am back at my car and uh thanks for doing this little tour of downtown hollister uh we'll do another one soon of different parts of downtown get you a better idea of other parts of the some of the side streets alleys uh south street which we, are we on South Street right now? No, we're not, we're on 7th. But South Street's got some amazing Victorian homes. Uh, a lot of these old buildings are great, like right over there, I don't know if you can see that. McKinnon Lumber, a uh, great place to get some lumber. Uh, but yeah, again, there's a lot of small businesses down here. There's starting a mural right there. So this is the other part of downtown. Maybe we'll do a, a part two of downtown. Uh, San Benito, downtown Hollister on Fat Guy in his backpack. 
but hopefully again knock on wood <laughs> I don't have wood so I'll knock on my car hopefully the sounds work in it looks normal so it's not slow-mo this time you get kind of an idea of what downtown Hollister California looks like so come visit us we're a fun town uh, great place to live uh, I need to shop more in downtown downtown tend to be small businesses uh, there's a quite a few of them that are empty here I'm looking across the street at at least two offices there there aren't busy but come check it out it's a great place to live great place to visit uh, we have San Juan Batista which is beautiful uh, I did a short little drive through one of these days I'll actually do a walk through and we'll actually show you the mission and what it looks like uh, but anyways there we go so thanks for watching fat guy is back back we are at 99 subscribers 99 one more one more will be at 100 how about five more and then we'll be at 104 huh? nice uh, even number there all right guys don't forget to like subscribe and leave a comment in that comment bar right below there so when you're watching the video if you scroll down a little bit there's a place where you leave a comment some ideas where I could do some films from that'd be great uh, I, I know I need to get better filming equipment right now I, I'm just using the, my Acaso uh, 7LE so it's poor man's version of the of the action camera uh, but it works does the trick and hopefully you got a better idea of what downtown Hollister is like so again like subscribe uh, leave a comment and be that 100th or 104th subscriber 99 I, I looked up at my feed this morning saw 99 that was so cool so I went from 97 to 99 so hey one more to a hundred and four more or five more to 104 when's the last time you were 104 in anything wouldn't that be exciting all right guys we'll see you next time a fat guy in his back